Hello everyone, Nickfire2 is here, and welcome back to the random Mugen Mania. So, things are going to be changing in the next few weeks, and I need to find a new time to do these recordings, because I'm not going to be able to do Friday recordings very soon. So, I might have to do these recordings in advance. Like, maybe a week or so in advance, but I'll think about it, and then I'll make a decision before the end of the month, because that's when I start a new job. Anyways, let's see how things are going to be going today. Okay, we got Paquito from the black car running team to the left. And on the right, we got Tony the Tiger. Or Fat Tony, I believe. He's running team in the right. Sitara from Astro Blade. Astro Buster versus 1KOF for our first round. And right King Stage from Tekken 3. Alright. Sitara. Sailor Neptune, I believe. No, no, Sailor Urine. I forget. Oh, wait, now I get. Sarah Pluto, that's what I believe. That might be right. One of the fires from Gojo and Paquito versus Wano One of the ponies from My Little Pony. I don't know third fighter is. And Fat Tony. And Titara just got crushed by, by Wano KOF. And Kermit's dead. That's not good. Yeah, Sarah Pluto. I don't know what that text was, but I'll have to look at it in editing or the upload. Uh, yeah. While well, Caleb is on a rampage, he's firing both Digas. Still going. Now I'm going to Sarah Pluto. He's still at it. Diavolo. Looks like it's a different version of Diavolo than I'm used to. I believe the second fighter in the right team is Princess Luna. It might be the, the Die Vulcan version of the Evolo that we see here, but I don't think we're gonna see the feet of Wanakuf okay, left, unless Pio does something. Who knows? Pio might get a victory here and take down Wanakuf, but. He has to do the entire team by himself now, because when I up, it's at full life. He has to take down three other characters, so... Who knows? He's blocking, but... Those grabs are still in consider. It's a counter. He still adds. No. This might be it. Yep, this probably is, but. Here he goes. There he goes. Boom! And everyone's freed. Even. Another giant Keo. But. Either way. OCV for Wan KOF. I'll have to make sure things. In the upload editing. But. Either way. That'll do it for match number one for today. Okay we got Tricky. 
from Madness Accelerator on Team the Left for our second match. I forgot to name that like that, that new brands thing. So I'll have to specify that in the description, but either way he's around team the left. And we got a fire from Nail Slug on team the right. I believe it's a super powered version of the standard captive. I believe there's a name, but it'll probably list it in the description as well. He's around team the right nonetheless. Ground coat from Plants vs. Zombies vs. Moko from Toho. And right the plug went to the M stage. Bye bye. Okay, ground coat, Leonardo. One of the fires from ah! Real Monsters. And Tricky vs. Moko AI. Batman. One of the Oscar Hunter Sense Fighters. And that captive from Mel Moko is just bringing the hurt on the brown goat, and down he goes. Next up we have is Leonardo. And I think I found the name of that fourth character on the right. It's Hyakutaro Ichimanji. Leonardo is not doing good. Moko's AI is just spamming those projectiles. Oh, he got hit. In. But. It's still not very good, but. He's still gotta try. Unfortunately, he wasn't fast enough. Alright, now we've got. Crawl! That's what his name is. Major damage. Down goes Crumb. Now it's all up to Tricky. Could Moko give us another OCV? Who knows? Well, it's possible because she's spamming projectiles once again. Despite that jump warp from Tricky, it didn't help. Oh, guard block. Oh, oh guard break. That's what's, yeah. Either way, OCV, Fujiwara Nomoko. All right. We just got one more match left to go for today. Who's gonna be entering the ring? Will we see something crazy like we did in the past few weeks? Who knows? Tamaki, around team to the left. And we got Hobocop, around team to the right. Rumi from Galaxy Fight versus Mizuki, or Shonjin from Samurai Showdown. And we're at the Hulk stage from Marvel Super Heroes. Alright, Rumi, Anarcho Fighter, Cinderace, and Tamaki versus Mizuki. I forgot the name of that game that Sunny Fire is from. I believe Third Fire is from Teenage Moon and Turtles and Mobile Cop. If I'm wrong, I'll write that in the description, as usual. Either way, Rumi is down, and. Um, I might want to look into what happened there, just in case. Sway Getsu is up. This is not looking good for the team on the right. Uh, not the team on the right, team on the left. Back in you, I think all the OCVs are from the team on the right so far. Well, for today, but Cinderace is up and he's already getting crushed. Kakariota. 
This is not looking good. I believe the second fire in the right is from Denjin Makai. I just saw that right now. As for the third fighter, I believe they're from, yeah, like I said, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles tournament fighters, but I might be wrong. But it's up to the Maki. She has to, to win this in order to, well, she has to OCB this in order to win now, but considering how brutal Mizuki is, especially your patch, it might not be likely. Oh, she is making some power attacks, so it's possible she might be able to turn us around. She might be able to at least stop the OCB. Who knows? Wait. She might have to do it. OCB prevented. Man. Here we got Tulks. And let me assure you guys, this character is not 18 plus. I mean, I hope it is. I remember having to change a lot of versions to even remove one character entirely because of the nature of one developer with some creations, but. Oh man, that. Who was Jewel Men 10 doing for pointing us out in the video last year? Anyways, Tolks is down. Tamaki took him out. War is up. Yeah, War is from Tarnit Fighters. I was right. I had the same thing as the time. It looks like. War is actually giving some, tr giving Tamai some trouble. A grab counter. There she goes. She's making a comeback. And she's, and War is down. Tamaki might just win this again. OCB herself. She just has to be Hobokao. She can beat him. That's it. And there we go! OCB comeback from Tamaki. That was... Man! Technically it's three OCBs, but... Not entirely from the first character. In the first round. Like, actually, like, one of the first characters to show up. That... That was something. Alright, you guys know the drill as always. This will never change, regardless of how things will change and how I do these videos, but you guys know what I'm talking about. If any of players Peter today have AI patches, or if they have better versions with better AI, but were not featured in this recording, please let me know in the comments below. I'll make sure to make those changes before next week, or at the future at the very least. Until then. Hope you enjoyed this brand new mania, and I'll see you guys next week for more of these intense battles. Until then, have a good rest of your day. Stay safe out there. Yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye bye.